Obo Sanjo is jealous of how foreign leaders are treating Buhari. Hello everyone, welcome to Newsport TV. The Buhari media organization BMO has alleged that former President Olusegun Obasanjo is envious of the good treatment and respect President Muhammadu Buhari enjoys from other world leaders. The organization also added that Buhari has performed better in office than Obasanjo was able to do during his time as the leader of Nigeria. The BMO, in a statement signed by its chairman, Niyi Akinsiju, and Secretary Kasidi Madweke said, Obasanjo ruled when there was an economic boom due to high oil prices, but Buhari skillfully managed the economy in a time of global economic crisis and COVID-19 outbreak. It therefore submitted that Obasanjo is at fault for claiming Buhari doesn't understand how to manage the economy. According to the BMO, now he, Obasanjo, claims Buhari does not understand the economy. And we wonder how someone who could not use the oil boom that Nigeria enjoyed under his administration to build a more structured economy than what we had throughout the PDP years. This is so hypocritical. This is the same man who presided over an 8% decline in economic growth from 15% in 2002 to 7.35% in 2003 and 6.59%. By the time also he added that over it was President Buhari who stems the tide of four consecutive PDP era GDP contractions between Q2 2014 and Q2 2015 and set the country on the path of growth with a more resilient and diversified economy from Q3 2015. We dare to say that many analysts with proper knowledge of economics have continued to express surprise that the Nigerian economy recorded a seventh consecutive quarter of GDP growth since the recession in Q3 of 2020 at a period of a sustained global slum. But for us, it is a reflection of the policies put in place by the Buhari administration, even before COVID-19 struck, that were targeted at winning the country off its overdependence on crude oil something former President Obasanjo failed to do. Buhari commands respect. The BMO statement added that President Buhari commands great respect from other world leaders and thus the jealousy from Obasanjo. As for foreign affairs, former President Obasanjo must be envious of the way leaders across the world are treating President Buhari with the regards he expected to have been reserved for only him alone, the statement added. So this is what is coming from Buhari media organization slamming on President Olusegun Obasanjo. As you know, when it was 2015, Obasanjo supported the, you know, presidency of um, the president, Buhari, and, um, but things have changed. The tides have been on and on, and ex-president Obasanjo has constantly written open letters to um, President Buhari about the state of the nation economic wise and especially security wise as well but a lot of times we can see that there's no consonance between these two ex-generals and um, over time especially this January 1st 2023 President Olusegun ex-president Olusegun Obasanjo decided to drop a bomb and he wrote an open letter where he openly endorsed the Labour Party presidential candidate Peter Obi against the candidacy of Ashiwa Jibola Ahmed Tinumbu of the All Progressive Congress. And since that time, it's been a lot of, you know, back and forth with the presidency aide slamming back at um, ex-president Lucia Gombasonjo. And he also, this time around, not being quiet, you know, being on different forum and giving it back to them, you know, with the same energy. Now, we know that this is the beauty of democracy. Everybody has the right to vote and be voted for, the right to choose a candidate or not to choose a candidate. And some were even arguing that ex-president Obasanjo doesn't have the clout to help um, Peter Obi win, that what is, the, what is the catch, you know? And some are even saying that he wants to do that so that he can be like a godfather kind of person because people are saying that Lucia Gombasanjo has not really been a godfather of any prominent person, 
you know, out there and all of that. Allegations against allegations, as people will always do, which is normal in any political setting or landscape. Now, with this, is it true that ex-president Richard Mobasanjo is jealous of President Muhammadu Buhari? Is it true that the economic policies of his administration and the current administration can be likened together? I think we'll leave the discourse for economics on the side of economics and also from the layman's point of view as well to say that how was he able also to tackle security? How what innovations did he bring into Nigeria and all of that? So these are points of discussions that people constantly talk about. But one thing that the youth will always mention when even the youngest of the youths that were born at that time is that they say about on just internet because it was during his administration that he was able to do the what we now enjoy that was when it started over there and all of that but the truth of the matter is we just want a nigeria that works because the youth are really upset with all our old politicians who have constantly been recycled from one to the other and nigeria just going down the drain taking one step forward and ten step backwards What's your opinion with these jealousy allegations by the...